Hey you guys, it is Tuesday, December 24th, 2019. The time is 7.45 p.m. Um, you probably saw by this video title, I'm going to show you what I got as my Christmas Eve present real quick. Uh, turns out there were some things added to the bag that I didn't know about. So in my previous video, um, I uploaded. There is not another thing in here that I wanted. Um, let me just dump it out here if I can, and then like put it all back at the same time because I think this bag looks really cool. I think that's everything, even though it has a name tag with my name on it. So, yeah, we're gonna start with the foundations. I got the um, Mac Studio Fix Fluid SPF 15. Sorry, Broad Spectrum SPF 15 in 4.5 foundation. I think this is the Pro Long Wear collection. Oh, it's a 24 hour wear buildable full matte found coverage foundation. It's oil and shine control, uh, which is this is like my br first brand new MAC Pro, like MAC foundation, like that was not a hand me down. This is what it looks like. Uh, only thing I don't like about it is this. It's really runny. I'm just seeing how runny it is. I'm not actually gonna pour it. <laughs> and I don't like the fact that it has a pump. It has no pump, I mean. I like having the pump. It smells like it's got paint in it. But I do like this foundation, so I'm definitely gonna try it tomorrow. I don't know how the hell I'm gonna get it out, because it's gonna be a joke to do without a pump. And, um... Uh, this next foundation has actually been a favorite on my channel for a while now because I've got an empty one right here. It's the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Water Foundation with uh, Broad Spectrum SPF 15 sunscreen. I've got the shade, uh, let's see, Fair Light Neutral. It's uh, 15N now, so it's Fair Light Neutral. So this is the old bottle. They actually changed the bottle since I last bought it. It's the exact same stuff, different bottle. This is my brand new one, this is my old one. Now I'm curious to know if this one's lid will screw onto this because uh, I actually love this foundation. I'm just gonna test it. If it doesn't work, I'm just gonna throw it away, which I doubt it will because they kind of look different. So we're gonna see here. Hmm, what do you know? It will fit, but I'm probably not going to keep it. I'm just going to keep the new one. So I got a brand new bottle here and an old bottle. Um, this is the 15N Fairlight Neutral and this is also Fairlight Neutral but it doesn't say a number on it. So I'm throwing this one away. That's the old one. This is the new one. I'm kind of excited for it because the new dropper and everything. I love foundation droppers and I also love the pumps as well. That's why I hope I can get a MAC pump before I use that stuff and like have an accident with it because I'll probably will cry. Um, I got some of the NYX Professional Makeup Soft Matte Lip Cream 8 Piece Vault. Uh, I actually had some of these before. I didn't have like these specific colors but I did have a couple in here. I had this one, this one, this one, and that one. And I had the purple one too. So I've had like five shades that are in here or something like that. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. We're actually going to open this on camera. I actually forgot this was in here. I think this was in my video when I uh, bought the MAC products. And uh, stuff like that. And it's a tradition in my family to open one gift on New Year's Eve. Sorry, sorry, Christmas Eve. So we can enjoy it the next day. And um, my mom said, yeah, you can do this one. Okay, so this is what they look like outside. The bag. Or the box, I mean. So, um, I've always wanted to have this color right here. The Cabo color. Uh, I never had it before. Now I got it. So... Thank goodness. Uh, also, I wanted the Color Havana Nights, which is uh, 
I don't think any of these is called Havana Nights. Oh, this one's called Havana. I thought it was Havana Nights. But my mom would never let me wear a color like that because it's too purple. Okay, now. Um, I got a MAC paint pod that I like in the color Painterly. Everybody says it looks like a concealer, but it's not really for that. I assume some people do use it as a concealer. But I'm just going to use it for like priming my eyelids before eyeshadow application. Like I do my other ones. Uh, I honestly, uh, I do have my other ones still. I'm very happy that I have them because now I've got four colors to choose from. That'll probably become a favorite one pretty quickly. And I got a, the color, I got a MAC matte lipstick in the color Velvet Teddy. Which is one of the colors I've been wanting for so long now. Um, this is what it looks like here. A lot of people I watch on YouTube actually have this color. And now I can say I have that color as well. But I'm not going to put any on tonight because uh, I'm just going to eat junk food and watch TV until I actually am ready to fall asleep. And I also got my first ever MAC wand concealer. It's the MAC... Um, I, mean, I picked up the wrong box, sorry. MAC Studio Fix 24 Hour Smooth Wear Concealer. And it's in the color NW20, which uh, a lot of my well, my mom and sister both said it looks like it's going to be dark on me. But uh, it might be, but it'll be under the perfect shade of foundation. Um, I was actually shade matched, and this time I got smart. I waited until my tan went away, because, you know, it smells like paint. My sister was not lying about that. It does smell like paint. Okay, now I got the MAC False Lashes Extreme Black Mascara, which uh, I have had a couple of MAC mascaras before, but I have not had this exact bottle. And I have seen it before. I've seen quite a few people have this one as well, and I just wanted to choose it for personal reasons. I mean, I like the wand. It has a light smell to it. I don't really know what to name that smell, because I think most mascaras smell like that, so I guess you can just say it smells like mascara. Even Maybelline makes ones that smell like that. Even uh, Too Faced does. And Too Faced is my all-time favorite brand of mascara. I think that's everything I got. Wow. <laughs> just these one, two, three four and five MAC products cost $180. Actually, the NYX lipsticks or lip glosses were like $12, so it was literally like, I'm just going to say about $170. But I'm actually pretty happy because I got these lipsticks. If I say lipsticks, I mean lip glosses because I call them all the same thing. And I put them literally in the same compartment of my makeup box. Uh, I'm going to place them down here for now in my uh, spirit lipstick bin. This just means I have uh, no idea where to put these lipsticks. It doesn't mean I'm getting rid of them, so don't think that. Um, also, I got this little Bodyology Cherry Blossom Spray. It was actually a gift from me to somebody in my family I thought liked Cherry Blossom, but they didn't want it, so I said, okay, rather than throwing it away, I'm just going to keep it, I guess. I know that sounded selfish, but Cherry Blossom is my favorite scent. I thought I bought uh, Black Cherry. That's what happened there. I must have made a mistake. I must have grabbed two bottles at the same time, and one said Black Cherry, and the other one said Cherry Blossom. I'm not the kind of person that would purposefully do that. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty excited, because uh, I got what I was after. I especially love this foundation. I actually probably should not have thrown away that bottle. I probably should actually keep it while the trash can is clean. 
I know that's unsanitary to dig it back out of the trash, but my trash can's clean. I took it out yesterday. The only thing in there right now is boxes. Um, I do have the matching concealer to it still. That's the whole reason I bought another one like that was because uh, I bought this about two months ago and I ran out of the foundation. So ever since then, this has just been sitting there. So this will probably be used tomorrow. And I'll probably use my MAC one the next day after. This actually doesn't smell that bad, so I might keep it for myself. I know that's kind of selfish sounding. Or I can just re-gift it for somebody. Because it is kind of brand new. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty excited. And tomorrow, I, there's more gifts to unwrap. So you'll get another video like this tomorrow. Um... Obviously, it's Christmas. I mean, um, almost everybody I know will have presents then. So, yeah. Um, I'll probably even be wearing the same shirt because this is actually a clean shirt, believe it or not. It's just made to look like this. And, uh, it's super comfortable. I love my concert shirts, okay? A couple of them got ripped in the washing machine in the last few weeks, and I'm kind of angry about that. But I really shouldn't be because I have, like, two or three of the same ones. And uh, one of them actually came from my first concert, so I don't give a crap if it rips all the way down through. I'm going to keep it. I'm going to put it in the shadow box and keep it because it has a lot of memories attached to it. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> That's it for now. Um, I'm hoping I got everything. I don't have the receipt in here. Somebody took the receipt out. But I'm pretty excited, so you might get a full face of Max tutorial again. Um, the reason I uh, say that was my first official Mac concealer that was brand basically brand new is because this is the only one I've ever owned, and this was not even bought by me. My sister bought it, and uh, I like it. I like the fact that it has the pump on it, but it is like six years old, so. This is probably going to hit the trash, too. I'm going to do a makeup clean out. I'm going to wait till after Christmas to do that, though, because uh, I got a strong feeling I got some more makeup down there under the tree. We're going to find out. Um, sorry, my eyeliner looks like crap, by the way. I've been waiting all day to do this video. The time is now 7.58 p.m. I don't know how long this will take to upload. We have very crappy Wi-Fi right now. Um, thank you for watching. Bye.